See this? This is my boomstick! We're just trying to press ourselves here. We're just trying to push ourselves, um, and you know, the more that we can do out here on the square range, the better off you're going to be when you know if you had to use it, you know, in the confines of your home or on your property or whatever in a defensive role. But the problem that presents itself requires a solid projectile. Right. So how do I get one out? Right. Yeah. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to index here, come half back. As soon as my hands touch the receiver, I know it's time to release my max for firing grip. Right. Press that in. Once I've seated that knife tube, uh, I can come out with the round that will fix my problem. In with the round that will. Index it, drop in the chamber, close your action, run around in the body. So, if I am transitioning without a sling to a secondary, it's already a bad situation, right? We don't want to make a bad situation worse. So if I'm transitioning over, okay, um, I'm, I'm still still carrying, sporting this uh, 10 pound weapon in my support hand and, and shooting my pistol uh, strong hand only, okay? That's where, um, you know, maybe if I just did a, uh, a quick combat reload, you know, I can get that gun back up in the fight. When I'm in the prone with the shotgun, okay, if I'm trying to support the shotgun here with uh, just here on my shoulder, it's gonna be hard to run my axe. So what I found is it's good to just roll that elbow in. So then when I'm shooting from the prone, I can actually still pick up my, my sight and I can still run my action. Cut! That's my target. My action's open, I'm good to go. I can move to cover, change to different positions. All right, first thing I gotta do after I run my pumpkins, get that action open. Leave it open, all right? Next thing you're gonna do when you break your shot, close that action, it's gonna lend to that recoil management. Nice.